Hey guys, uh, just wanted to give you a little update. We had to make a pit stop. We're here at, I don't know if you can see that or not, but we're at Walmart. Um, I'm sure you can see the snow a little bit, but we decided to stay here. We're not the only ones. There's some others here also, but 30 mile an hour wind. Mile hour yeah, 45 mile an hour tonight. Um, slit snow, it was sleeting earlier, raining. Um, so we're just gonna chill at Walmart, gotta do grocery shopping anyway. But uh, anyway, so just wanted to let you know what we're doing. But we're going back in, it's cold. All right, guys. Well, we are at Milford Lake here in uh, where are we at? Junction Junction City, Kansas. Junction City, Kansas. It's um, right off the highway, about five miles right off the highway. Yeah. It's a really pretty lake. Mm -hmm. um, give you a little view here, what it is. I give you I give you a little view, and then uh, <clears throat> talk about it a little bit. We got here last night found a spot there's some people camping uh, right not too far from us they've got about four campers I think out there yeah. I'm not sure if they're living there or what but uh, they're pretty old I think they were welding on something yesterday I'm not sure <laughs> but this is a really beautiful lake it, it would be but um, there's just trash everywhere people have thrown cans and beer cans and soda cans and uh, spare tires uh, up by the campfire by the fire ring one of the fire rings there's a the part of, of a, a car TV. door there's back of a TV back of a TV up there mm -hmm. um, I don't know if there's homeless living out here or what but mm -hmm. I mean there's nobody out here right now except for us and the other campers I mean there's farmers that live out here but there's, this yeah. place would be really nice and you know what it's not just the people that left the stuff it's the city that doesn't come out here and clean it up mm -hmm. so there's two parties to blame for that but um I mean, just because somebody's, you know, doesn't care enough and they go ahead and dump stuff doesn't mean the city shouldn't pick it up. Right. So. That and to the people that use the free sites, clean up after yourself too, though. Right. So, but anyway, this is uh, where, it at, where we're at. This is another one of those uh, public day use areas. But if you can see over there, spare tire in the lake, there's another one right down from there. Uh, that's two of them right there. We'll just walk down this way. Parked right up there. I don't know if you can see. I can't barely see over that bank. There we are. And then we'll walk up here and we'll show you. It gets a little less pretty up here. <laughs> we'll show you. Yeah, we'll show you how dirty it is up here. And I'm. Hoping probably only this area may be like this. I don't know. We haven't seen the rest of the lake. But. So here's where we're at. And as you can see, it's just filthy. I mean, it's just garbage everywhere. And there's other campers. Mm -hmm. and then over the there, that's the, uh, the the restrooms, the vault toilet. Pretty clean in there. I mean, it's not 
garbage or anything, but people do come out here with their four wheelers and do donuts. That and back in there, if you're tent camping, there's definitely some good little spots that you could tent camp in there. Watch out though, there's some big thorn bushes back oh, there. Yeah. Anyway, we'll uh, we'll leave the GPS coordinates uh, in the description of the video. But it's been quiet out here. I mean, other than being dirty, it's not bad. So for a night's nice rest, it's not bad. We're just staying out of the wind. So. So these are the bathrooms. Just a vaulted toilet, but it's a nice size and plenty of toilet paper and it's cleanish. You got your trash can. And they also have a big dumpster on our way out of here too. All right, guys, well, we ended up moving um, this morning. Last night, the winds got up to about 65 mile an hour gusts, but they were um, steady winds, about 50 mile an hour. So, got a little bit rocky last night. Um, we were already on leveling blocks, so it was pretty bad, but we were down there, and all we did was kind of come down behind these trees right here. It's just the small patch of trees that there is. <laughs> yeah, but. So we're, we're right here now, so, yeah. Made a huge difference <clears throat> whenever we moved. Just some, uh, yeah, just some little bit of trees right there made a big difference. So we're, we don't even really notice the wind right now, but my God, last night at one o'clock in the morning, it was crazy <laughs> out here. Yeah. But uh, yeah, so tomorrow everything's supposed to calm down and uh, I think we're gonna get on the road. There's a camping world about four hours from here in Columbia, Missouri, so we're heading there. I yeah. uh, need to pick up a couple of things um, and then from there we're going to head down to Merrimack River in Missouri. Yeah. So we uh, need to go by and get a, <clears throat> a rack for our lawn chairs. We just got them tied up right now. They're under pretty good and I got a, a bike lock. Oh yeah, and I got a cable lock yeah. on there. So, but uh, anyway, oh, I don't know if I showed them the hubcaps. Oh, I don't know, probably not. We got our hubcaps. They're the good ones. Nice, <laughs> yes, they're solid. Um, the rear ones are uh, deep well. The they were not the la the last ones that fell off were um, not deep well. They were something else. Yeah. They were almost like the front ones there. But yeah, looks 110% uh, better than it did. Yeah. Looks like we're by the ocean. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, we are going to get out of here in the morning, so we'll talk to you later. Bye, guys. What's the name of this place again? Mm, um, it's Rolling Hills Public Day Use Area. Rolling Hills? Mm -hmm, and that's Milford Lake. All right, guys, so this is uh, Rolling Hills Public Day Use Area. Uh, that's Milford Lake. Uh, we'll leave the GPS coordinates uh, link below.